Hey guys, happy Monday. I am en route to my doctor's appointment to have the test done on my heart. In 3.8 so, miles, turn left onto Wilson Road. To, um, yeah, I have to have them, um, two different part, um, things done on my heart to see hopefully what the issue is, if there be any, and see what, what goes from there. But how y'all doing this morning? I'm doing good. Doing good. It's a rainy, rainy day out today. And the temperature has dropped down to the 60s. But other than that, it's a really good day. Uh, I'm kind of nervous. But, you know, pray about it and, you know, just leave it in God's hands. Leave it in God's hands, basically. Um, yeah, that's it. After my appointment, I have to come back home and work. Get some more work done. And I'll probably have to stay over until about 6 o'clock or so today working. And all that good stuff, but it's all good. It's all good. Oh, so my um, loan officer emailed me this morning and about to go down now we're about to begin the underwriting process and for those home buyers know that's the most that's the most stressful process of the home buying um, of home buying that's the most stressful thing you know they want everything check stubs 401k w2s um, dna <laughs> Your current address, your previous address. I mean, come on. But I'm hoping because we we have been previous home buyers that you know it'll be a lot smoother this time around because that first time was really really difficult. That first time it took us a long. We were in underwriting a long time. Um, and like I said, hopefully this time around it's a lot easier. Um, and we we can get through it because of our you know previous history so um, I will definitely keep you guys updated like I said it's a process I'm taking you guys along with us um, everything is not always gonna be peaches and cream but I'm hoping that at least the underwriting process is peaches and creams this time around um, I'm just asking you guys to continue to pray for us as we go through this and um, yeah we'll do the same for you guys Anyway, guys, let me get off this camera, driving in the rain, and so I can pay attention. And I will get with you guys when I'm in the doctor's office. Right. Hey, guys. So I never got back with you guys after um, I left the doctor's office, but um, I had all the the tests done, and they also had me on a, a monitor. Sorry, guys. Uh, just want to show the things. They also have me on a monitor for 24 hours, so I have to go back tomorrow to um, get this taken off. And um, I guess what they're going to see is the activity, my heart activity, monitor my heart activity for 24 hours. And that's it. So hopefully I will know something by the end of this week. And um, I'm in high spirits, so hey, we're going to take it as it comes. But yeah. I will get with you guys later. Hey guys. Happy Tuesday. So I am getting ready to take these off and take it back to the clinic. Um, this is called a Holter monitor and it monitors your heart. And so I've had it on for now 24 hours. So um, now I get to take it off and uh, put it in a Ziploc bag and drop it off at the the clinic where I um, where they put it on. I have wires all down here. Sorry, guys, I'm still in my night clothes, but yeah, I have wires all over me. So I'm getting ready to take it off and take it back. So figured I would video a little bit of it because it's my journey. And 
Do you want to take you? Thank you guys. See. See it. like a little cell phone pack. <laughs> Alright guys, I guess I'll uh, cut this part short because I gotta do all that and I know men watch this too so I'm not trying to be rude and flash myself so I'll be back. There I am. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to come back and show you guys. Everything that I had connected to me. Little hotel monitor. The monitor is in here. So I guess they're gonna take take this out and connect it and get their reading. But for now I'm gonna put it in a little ziploc bag and take it back. this morning now it's trying to get sunny out here a little bit may turn out to be a nice day but it's a, it said it was going to be 80 percent y'all know them weather people those weather forecasters sometimes they don't know what they be talking about talking about it's going to be 80 90 percent chance of rain and it only rain for like 20 percent so did y'all see that it's clouds in the sky but it's not that bad. So, hopefully it turns out to be a beautiful day. But either way, rain, sleet, sleet or snow, we still gonna make it a good day. Focus. Hey guys, so I am home. I have um, finally dropped off the monitor and hopefully they said by Friday I should um, know something so between now and friday i really need you guys to be praying that everything is okay in the meantime i went and got me a filet of fish from mcdonald's and i got my husband something because he has to go to work a little bit later so i got him something and i picked me up a filet of fish and now i'm just sitting here working and watching youtube as usual but yeah, I just wanted to come on and let you guys. My battery had died. That's why I didn't get any more footage. But yeah, um, when I get off a little bit later, I'm going to hit the gym because I feel like I'm just <sighs> slipping. And I dare not weigh myself because I know I haven't lost any weight. But yeah, I'm um, hit the gym around 5 or 6 o'clock and come home and hit the books. And that's gonna be my night. But um, yeah guys, that's it. Hey guys, it's about six o'clock in the evening and I was gonna go to the gym, but it has gotten really, oh crap. I just broke my freaking glass. Y'all see that? Oh crap. Can't win for losing. 
it done got cold out there and it's windy so i'm gonna sit my tail right in this house finish cooking dinner i'm baking some chicken with corn and green beans and vegetables i'm about to make me a glass of wine because i am tired and i have a lot of homework to do okay so Today I had to sign, we had to sign off on our loan documents and all that good stuff and yeah, this is the process I don't like, but it's a process we have, we all have to go through when you, when you buy a house. So I definitely, definitely need me a glass of wine, a big glass of wine. And this is my favorite wine, y'all. So, if y'all ever want to send me something, send me some of that. Yeah, that's my favorite wine. It's not, it's not um, dry. I don't like dry wine. So, that's why I like, I don't like, um, what's the name of that wine? I can't think of the name. I can't say Moscato. Moscato is good, but to me, Moscato is really, really too sweet. I'm more into red wines instead of um. Derek, what you doing? The clear wine. What you doing? Get up. Say hey. Do you think he notices that we're whispering like this? No, but we're too deep to turn back down. Lazy DJ. DJ. You playing like you sleep? Hmm. Why you playing? He don't want to be on camera. Anyway, guys, we're just chilling. I'm about to edit a video so y'all can have a video tomorrow, Wednesday, as promised. Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. Um, gonna try to keep my word unless something else comes up. But um, yeah, I'm cooking dinner. Thank you, baby. And chilling. So I'm gonna catch y'all in a minute. All right, guys, I just wanted to come on and say good night. We're about to clean. We just finished eating dinner, but um, yeah, we're about to clean and um, I'm about to take a shower and hit the books. Um, anyway, I will see you guys on Friday. Good night, guys.